The Education USA Opportunity Funds program basically assists highly qualified students who are likely to be awarded full financial aid from US colleges and universities, but who lack the financial resources to cover the upfront costs of obtaining admission. We cover costs such as testing, application fees, visa fees, service fees, airfare, and sometimes a settling in allowance. Education USA advisors work with Opportunity Fund students in 43 countries around the world. I think that's cause for applause. And so we went from what we planned as 19 scholars and we ended up with, with 30. So we're really, really, really happy. Um, and the reason why is because these experiences are life changing. Your life after your study in the United States, after a world-class American education, will not be the same. It will be different. Um, you will have so many different experiences in the United States, and we're just so happy that we are just a small part um, of, of that chain of success that all of you have earned through your scholarships, through your hard work, through your raw determination and your ambition to be able to get to this point so far. So we are so, so proud of all of you and all of your efforts and what you've done. There are 14,000 Nigerian students in the United States. That is not by accident. And so we are very happy that you are joining those ranks. Nigeria is the 11th largest sending country of Nigerian students to the United States. Nigerians study at over 1,000 universities and colleges in the United States. Um, so that's a really, really big achievement. We're just so proud to see how this program has grown. As you know, we started in 2013 with three students. And this year, we're up to this cohort, and we hope next year even more so. And I just encourage you to maximize this opportunity. Um, you know, you've got this great opportunity to broaden your horizons. You are all very serious students. We don't want you just to complete your program. We want you then to use what you've learned to come back to Nigeria, and as you heard from one of our students, to, to really bring those skill sets back and imagine uh, the future of Nigeria. My name is Kendi Adebiyi, and uh, I was born in Lagos State, Nigeria. I lived all, through, all my life in Baika local government, which is a ghetto. Growing up was truly an echoing task. You know, I was born in a family of three, and my parents could not even afford daily meals. I attended public school through my primary, secondary, and also university education at Lagos State University. But to get myself here is truly exhilarating and highly exciting. Noting the challenges I've gone through, I've witnessed you know, the sad reality of poverty, I grew up in an environment with a lot of climate change issues, pollutions, and came strong to this stage. It's truly an opportunity for me, and I'm grateful to God and my parents. I heard about the ed Education University Opportunity for Scholar. That was last year when I graduated with a first class degree honors from the Lagos State University Department of Microbiology. I applied, and I'm thankful to have been selected out of hundreds of applicants to get to this stage. It's truly an humbling process, and also a result of hard work and dedication. Noting that I'm going to Indiana University this fall to start a PhD in microbiology. Well, I hope to conduct research around infectious diseases and come back to the country to be a professor of microbiology is truly an humbling privilege for me. And I hope to do more for the future and also give back to the country. I'm grateful to Education USC Lagos for this wonderful opportunity because identifying brilliant mind and talent is the best thing Nigeria needs for growth. And I'm glad to be part of this story. Hello, my name is Ruth Olujobi. I am the last child in a family of eight. I grew up in Ikorodu, Lagos State here in Nigeria, and for the most of my life, I have schooled there. Now, I got to hear about the Education USA program when I was in SS3 through a family member who saw my academic achievements and thought, oh, Ruth, you can do this. In school, I put in my best. I was doing a lot of leadership um, positions. And even though I didn't know that I wanted to apply to the United States, I was doing this out of passion. Now, although I come from a low-income family where my mom is a petty trader and my dad a retired junior civil servant, 
they wanted the best for us and so they knew education was very important and because of that I put in my very best and made sure I was always topping my class. Because of my academic achievements I was able to apply to and get into the Opportunity Funds program by Education USA. It has not been easy, I will not deny that. But then I understood that one yes could change everything for you, one yes could change the trajectory of your life and because of that I put in my very best. Now I'm in, I'm going to the United States. Everything has changed, nothing's the same anymore. I applied in 2020 for the program, went through the process and um, gracefully I got in. I have a bachelor's degree in biochemistry from Adekun Lajash University, Akumba Koko, where I graduated with the first class. And I uh, also hold a master's degree in biochemistry from the University of Lagos. Uh, I grew up in Akure, in a local community in Akure, in those states, uh, those states uh, in Nigeria. So um, I'm the first child of my family. Uh, it was quite uh, a bit tough while growing up, but uh, thank God uh, I had a supportive parent. My dad happens to be a teacher, a secondary school teacher, and then my mom is, they're both retired now, actually. So getting into the Education USA Opportunity Fund program was actually uh, a great thing for me because I don't know how it I will have been able to go to the US for my graduate study. So I'm really grateful for this opportunity. My name is Uriri Bosco Otite. I am from Delta State in Nigeria. I studied civil engineering at the University of Port Harcourt and I graduated with the first class. I emerged as the first student to ever graduate with the first class in the Department of Civil Engineering at the University of Port Harcourt. I also emerged as the first graduating student for the entire Faculty of Engineering for my academic year. Um, after graduation, I moved to Lagos for my NYSC and a friend of mine told me about Education USA, Opportunity Funds Program. At the time, I didn't even know about it. I hadn't heard about it, so I thought to apply and it was, has been an amazing journey ever since. My dream is really, really centered around the civil engineering industry here in Nigeria and how we are stuck at using our old ways and how I, my interests have always been going to learn about novel materials, green materials that can replace these our conventional materials. So my dream is to come back to Nigeria and incorporate those new construction materials into the industry here in Nigeria.